After receiving a request from one of my followers, I have published a sample employee appraisal form in response. This form is designed to be simple and user-friendly, allowing employers to easily evaluate the performance of their employees. In the accompanying lesson, I have provided a detailed, step-by-step -step guide on how to fill out the form and generate a final evaluation report. With this tool and my instructions, employers can streamline the appraisal process and ensure that their employees are receiving fair and accurate evaluations. The template provided is completely editable and can be customized to meet the specific needs of your organization. To get started, simply replace the existing logo with your own company logo. You can also use the picture formatting options to further customize the template to your liking. This will ensure that the final product is tailored to your organization and reflects your unique brand identity. In order to begin the evaluation process, you will need to enter some basic information into the form. This includes the name of your company, the name of the employee being evaluated, and the department within the organization. Additionally, you will need to indicate the type of evaluation being conducted, whether it is an annual review or an interim evaluation. The evaluation form has been designed to encompass four key sections, such as evaluation criteria, overall performance, opportunity to comment on the employee's potential for growth and development, and finally the selection and evaluation section. The initial section of the evaluation form is dedicated to defining the evaluation criteria and establishing a clear framework for the assessment. Each criterion is assigned a rating on a scale of 0 to 4, with 0 indicating unsatisfactory performance and 4 representing outstanding performance. The evaluation criteria can be customized to align with the specific needs and goals of your organization. To assign a rating for each criterion, simply click on the corresponding checkbox. If a particular criterion is not applicable to the employee being evaluated, simply mark it as such using the does not apply checkbox. This will ensure that the evaluation is accurate and tailored to the individual being assessed. Once all of the evaluation criteria have been assessed and rated, the score is automatically calculated based on the selected scale ratings. The form will tally the performance ratings and multiply them by the weighted score before dividing the result by the total number of applicable criteria. This process results in a final score representing the employee's overall performance. For example, an employee may receive a final score of 78%, indicating that they have performed well in the areas evaluated. This score can serve as a valuable tool for identifying strengths and weaknesses, setting goals for improvement, and making informed decisions about promotions, compensation, and other employment-related matters. After analyzing the final results and evaluation, the third section of the form presents an opportunity to provide feedback on the employee's potential for growth and development. This section highlights the areas where the employee has excelled and identifies areas where improvement may be needed. These insights can be invaluable in supporting ongoing employee development and helping the employee to reach their full potential. Finally, the selection and evaluation section provides a concise summary of the key findings from the evaluation, offering a clear assessment of the employee's overall performance. These sections work together to provide a comprehensive and insightful evaluation that can guide decision-making and support ongoing employee development. The template is available for free download from the link provided in the description, but before I invite you to show your appreciation by liking this video and subscribing to my channel for more useful content in the future.